welcome to online mbbs and today we are gonna learn about digits of the year and as the year is divided into three parts we learned in the previous lecture they are external year the middle year and the internal year so let's learn one by one so let's start with digits of the external year and the digits of the external year is classified uh, according to these following six categories classification okay according to this following six categories they, they are congenital and then inflammatory or infective and the third one is reactive The fourth one is trauma. Fifth one is tumor. And the last one is other. The disease of the external ear are categorized according to this congenital, congenital disease, inflammatory or infective disease, reactive, traumatic, tumor, and others. So let's learn what disease come under the congenital. So under the congenital disease comes preauricular sinus, preauricular sinus. The next one is collateral fistula, collateral. Fistula. And the third one. The third one is congenital anomalies of pinna. Congenital anomalies of pinna and under this comes anosia that is absence of pinna macrosia that is excessive larger size pinna and microsia okay And the fourth one is atresia, external canal. These four diseases comes under the congenital. And let's learn the second condition, that is inflammatory, inflammatory or infective. So under this, the following disease come. They are pericondritis, pericondritis, that is erysipelas, cellulitis, and the next one is furunculosis, furunculosis. And the third one is otitis externa, otitis externa, and under otitis externa, this otitis externa is sub classified into. Acute otitis externa, subacute, 
and chronic. Acute is of less than four weeks. Less than four weeks duration, and this is we can say four weeks. And the chronic is more than four weeks. No, sorry, not equal to more than four weeks. And also there is one malignant malignant otitis external and then our fourth is otomycosis and the fifth one is herpes joster herpes joster oticus also known as Ramsey Hunt syndrome so these are the inflammatory conditions now let's learn about the third one that is reactive under reactive comes the eczematous Eczematous otitis external. And the number two is seboric. Seboric otitis external. Now let's learn about the fourth condition. D. That is traumatic. Under the traumatic category comes the following disease. They are injury to auricle, injury to the auricle. They are abrasion or laceration. And the second is frostbite. Third one is Keloid and number fourth is hematoma, hematoma oris, that is keloid of auricle. Okay, this one auricle or pina, they are the same. And the fifth one is injury, injury to the tympanic membrane. They comes under the traumatic con uh, condition, and the number fifth condition is tumor. Under the tumor comes ectostosis, also known as surfer sear, which mainly occur to the surfer who dive in the sea. And the number second is adenoma of external canal. And number sixth condition is others. And under this comes serumin or wax. Keratosis, obturans, the number third is foreign bodies, foreign bodies, and the foreign bodies, they are animate and inanimate, inanimate, which means living and non-living. It may be some uh, any insects under animate or in, 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 under inanimate maybe uh, some pencil or any object. And let's learn about the disease of the tympanic membrane, which also comes under the external ear. Disease of the tympanic membrane. Under disease of the tympanic membrane comes. 
retracted retracted tympanic membrane and the number second is meningitis bullosa number third is traumatic rupture number fourth is tympanoesclerosis so these all were the disease of the external ear now let's learn about the disease of the middle ear diseases of the middle ear so under this comes the otitis media media for the middle ear and external for the external ear okay and this is further subdivided into acute and chronic okay now we are just learning the topic okay? just the disease name in the next lecture we will learn in detail we will explain all the disease today we are le just learning the disease topic name okay just the disease name what disease comes under the ear and the second is colis teatoma the third one is otosclerosis auto sclerosis these are the disease of the middle ear and now comes the disease of the internal ear so under this what disease comes first is benign paroxysmal positional vertigo positional vertigo also known as BPPB the number second is many years disease many years disease the third one is vestibular neuritis the fourth one is levy rhinitis let's write the fifth one here that is acoustic neuroma and the sixth one is autotoxicity autotoxicity so these are the disease of the internal ear so let's learn which one are important disease most common most commonly seen and important for the exam point of view so in disease of the external ear under congenital this pre auricular sinus is a bit common and then collateral fistula under inflammatory furunculosis is uh, common otitis externa this is more important and then herpes chuster orticus that is ramsey hunt syndrome also a bit important and here you can see the foreign bodies foreign bodies very important for the exam and this one this is under the of the middle ear you can see what it is media this is the most important for the exam point of view and this is of the internal ear many years disease is important many years disease and this benign paroxysmal positional vertigo these are the most important disease in the disease of the ear let's uh, so see in, see you in the next video hope you like the video okay see you bye bye